Okay, um, hello, here we are in Publisher. Uh, what we're going to have a look at is how to create um, textiles, which you need to do for Unit 5 AO2. Now, um, I have a brand new publication here, um, the Home tab, and you can see here in the middle, we've got a Styles button. If I press that, I can input styles, or what I want here, though, is to create a new style. So let's click on New Style, and you get this window come up. Now it's worthwhile after you put your style name in taking a screenshot of this window uh, to use as evidence. I'm going to create a style um, what if I hit use for headings for main headings in my in my uh, publication so let's call it headings because that's what it is. Let's have an MB at the end which is my initials so I know that's my style this is at the point that you would take a screenshot of this to show that you've actually created a new style uh, with the name headings MB or whatever your one is. Okay, just for this video, I'm going to just, um, you'll notice these buttons, and these are important buttons down the side here, six of them. This is where I change uh, different aspects of my new style. And I'm going to look at, just for this video, look at the change in the font. So, let's click on that, and you'll get this window come up. Now again, what you'll want to do is take a screenshot of this window before you change anything. So you've got a before and after shot once you have changed everything. So you take a shot now, make your changes, take a screenshot afterwards. To get just the active window when you print screen, just press uh, the Alt key and print screen and then it will just print screen the active window and it will save you messing around having to crop everything up. Okay, so I've got this. I'm going to take a screenshot screen of this that's what you do and then we're going to make some changes and you can see the changes that I make I've actually illustrated down there in this sample box um, so I'm going to uh, let's choose a text style one I like because I only like certain text styles and um, let's see if I've got some of my favorites in it um, it doesn't matter it, it doesn't matter to me yeah uh, this is the one I like uh, my Andra GT and there it is down there. So I've chosen that. It's kind of small, so I'm going to change the size of that. Remember, these are headings, so I want it quite big. It's 22. That looks good. Uh, 22. What font style? Regular, italic, bold. Let's make it bold. Just so that it's yeah, quite nice. And let's have a lovely bright colour. What kind of look nice? Yeah. Let's have a lovely red. There. Yeah. Okay. So I've changed the font style. I've changed the um, emphasis that, that really is, whether it's bold or italic or just regular. I've changed the size and I've changed the colour of the font. Now before I leave this window, what you'd need to do is take a screenshot of this and to go with the first one before you made any changes, so you get your before and after shots so you can tell, see exactly what it is you've changed. OK that, and it comes back to this window. I'm going to look at the, the uh, character spacing in the next video, but for now that's probably enough for this one. Okay, I'm going to locate that.